got an excuse for is it Pagolia or whatever the fuck it's called where people are supposed to see faces in shit and that but yeah she's talking about holograms these two could be wearing holograms but then at the same time you've got to ask yourself well if these people wear masks and things like that would they need to wear masks if they've got solid holograms but then do, do solid holograms are they hard to make are they expensive is it time consuming what is it can't you know if they've got a solid hologram would they still need to wear a mask to deceive people or can they just change a coding or something on that that gives them a fucking different hologram or is it all you know are we just being fucking frequency fucked so we can't see actually what's going on you know but these people talking about it all have these symptoms still and you know this is why i know most people in these sections are these people in my comment section and in other comment section and other videos because you all have the same shit the same type of videos the, the, the very same sort of looks and none of you all post about it and seem to give any fucking solutions you know amount of people that come in my comment section you know pointing this out and saying that but yet they ain't got no content never done no content if you were a real human being and you could spot this shit you'd probably speak out about it or at least have some videos showing it not the fucking standard justin bieber shit that goes round that you know, that I believe that's put out there or the fucking Jenna Bushwick fucking liquid crystals. That shit is meant to be there to fucking throw you off or at least so they can mock the people that do believe it by putting it on mainstream media and stuff like that. So let's carry on with these two. Uh, their fingertips, which we are unaware of. We're unaware of, yeah, because as we know, there's there's a lot out there. Um, and, and say things like... Um, they could use a body double as well, like for the queen, they'd use a body double and then they'd project her, her onto her. So she could be out in the public for totally looking like that person. They get a, a body double. That just sounds project. like fucking mm, projecting or manipulating photons and stuff like that. Like if you can do it in public or oh, <laughs> we are just blind to the frequency control. fucking that they are doing to us control. on a daily basis. Creation, really. Look at her scratching her fucking that head there, and her eyes will go so into shit. Kind of, so she knows you know, it's happening. Do this, but when they show us, remember when they did the Queen's speech with CGI as, as yeah, as on Channel Four, but they, they show us it's you so can't bad. believe anything so that's on a screen, and especially and the digital age really that we're in is. now. And then you think, oh, well, we'd know if they were doing that. They show us it really badly done. They, yeah, they did the hologram as well, didn't they? Yeah, the, and then everyone was waving. Yeah, for the hologram. Yeah, which again is. Shows and they haven't done that's a fucking um, touching her ears and shit like that. Rappers. Yes, they've done holograms, they then doing concerts. They're getting you can see through them, they're not, yeah, they're not. Um, so they, they show us that they've got the technology. Look at them unround really pupils that yes. humans yes. supposedly yes. have. So we've got meat that's suit that's Bex so and meat so suit Tash here flexing in the meat suits, talking shit, leading us down garden paths. Rainbow. See, we saw a flick um, up then. And what colours don't you see in a rainbow? See, there we go, rainbow, um, the spectrum. Is pink. Everything seems to be I mean, a spectrum that we're on, you know what I mean? I don't even know that's well, what I go mean. by the chakras. Okay. Because you've got rainbow. That's another thing. They all talk rainbow. about the chakras yeah, and shit like rainbow. that. I'm not saying it's not real, like but it, like there's a big fucking blue, blue, common denominator. Blue, You've all got well, slit pupils, blue, your fucking hands go to shit. Blue, you know, you look like you're wearing blue, fucking blue, masks and fucking blue. have shitty yeah, fucking yeah. hair yeah. that don't even look fucking real. The heart centre is green. Green. And also, if you just look at a rainbow, there isn't pink in it. Oh, it's, there isn't pink in there. So basically, in the rainbow it's spectrum, part of the spectrum. No, no. You've got red at one end, right, and violet at the other. Um, and but there is no species of light. And they're free, yeah, but there is no violet because violet is actually a deep shade of blue. Well, this violet red, thing that we, we, me yeah, and my and mate and spoke about, this, this is what we think that that's the spectrum that they're, they're, they're trying to block blue, is the violet yes. and stuff like that. You've got the tyrian purples and stuff like that that you look at everything that they are trying to block and I've had a discussion with a, with my friend and we think that it is the purple UV spectrum that they are that they are you know trying to block especially and they try to block everything that gives natural UV which are animals and things that they can collect this sort of stuff from so I do you know 
I do think what these talking about, there is some merit to some degree, but I don't think that they're giving you it all. It's the same with the dye cyanin dye and the things like that. It's a different spectrum as some people have shown. And you know, this this realm or whatever that we live in, they've made all this technology, all as cameras. So it is fitted with with filters and um, things that knock a spectrum out or do things like that because obviously the better quality the the the, fo the photos have got and the videos you know that's when that they seem to push a lot more of the fake reality stuff they couldn't push the fake reality stuff with the bad images years ago as as what they do now and that's what you've got to ask yourself what excuses can they use when they're giving you a bad picture you know and that's what i think it is so the violet is basically still on the, the, blue, spectrum. the blue spectrum, yeah. yeah. So the only way that purple is created and experienced is in the 2D visible light spectrum. So that's how we see it. So we're seeing it in a, instead of 3D. It's two dimensional. We're seeing it in a, a two line, dimensional, it? it's yeah, just, it's basically. So Slice, the, the, so the wave. To wrap Look at these the two shells, whatever you are. The opposing ends, red and violet. Okay, because so you've got red at this end, yep. base chakra, and you've got... Yeah, your the purple. I, I, yeah. My other so thought of thing purple, on this is, is if we emit light when we're, together. if we emit light yeah. when we think yeah. and things yeah. like that, yeah. and when we're walking round in truth, if we can't see on this spectrum, I always have this sort of a, of a vision in my head. It's like when you're walking round and someone just takes a look at you, and it's like they want to avoid you or they, they, they seem to have it in for you, and you've never met them. And you wonder whether that's their entity looking at your entity or whether they can see what your thoughts are or what you're resonating at. And if you're resonating, at a, at a, say, like, I don't know, the purples that they're on about, you might be aware of your, your surroundings, your perception of reality might be what they can see. So when they can see a different coloured light or, or a different, you know, a brightness of light or whatever they know that you're thinking these thoughts and that's why you either get attacked or they come away from you because they don't want to be around you because they can see the light that you're emitting through your thoughts that you know that they so when you're emitting that light through your thoughts they know what color light these tears or beans or whatever that can see on that spectrum know that when you're walking around in crowded areas and they, they spot you they know that you're thinking about that people around you might not be like you so you're resonating at a frequency that's showing the the beings around you that can see that you are looking at your perception of reality different to a lot of what everybody else is and that's why they keep an eye on you or they know that throughout your life you've resonated at a certain frequency and they've tried to dump you down or you know throw you off track to try to get you to the lower you know chakras if that's what you want to call them to start committing other stuff like sex you know acts and other sorts of you know things along that sort of line but yeah this purple thing you know me and my mate did speak about this and we have got some theories on it you know, with the stuff to Daphne Shaw, with, with some jellyfish or something like that, it was. It's together. Those together, yeah. Right. And they're with not you. supposed to be connected. No. They're not supposed so to they're be connected. not a natural occurrence of light. No, they're designed to be on the opposite end of each other because they have extreme opposing polar force energetically and they emit very, very different energies. So the violet has very high energy and the red has a much lower frequency and wavelength mm -hmm. when you look at the spectrum. Mm -hmm.